I've got a little treat for you today, here today only. This ain't in a trucking uh, stop. <clears throat> Don't, the truck didn't back into that and knock it over. What's funny is they do have a little truck stop over here. They have a little sign out with that little water tire leaning over on the side. <laughs> this is uh, east of Amarillo, Texas, going back into Oklahoma City. This is Texas. Haven't had any rain out here for a while, and the grass looks like it's had the first freeze already. Looks like it's already winter and the grass is frosted. Got a little corn there that's uh, been on some water irrigation, and looks like it's just about right. The tassels are all turning brown, the leaves are browning, but still a little bit of green stalk on it. Who'd have thought? Corn in Amarillo, Texas. Oklahoma City, 219 miles. We'll be going through Clinton, uh, Sayre, Eric, Oklahoma. We'll be hitting the Oklahoma border up here just any time. Uh, I think I'll go through Groom, Texas. Uh, they got a uh, crop out there in the field that's green and uh, obviously has been watered. Like I said, uh, the grass over here under uh, normal conditions there has been no water for 40 something days. It's been under 100 degrees from here through to Oklahoma City. And uh, so there's just nothing's been growing. Hay pasture, they've been dumping horses and cattle into the market, selling them cheap on the hoof price by the pound because uh, people can't afford the hay and the feed because there is no pasture left. Pastures just totally burn up. Like you put a herd of cattle on that grass right there, and once the grass is gone, there's nothing growing back in its place. It's just gone. It's down to dirt. There's no replenishing the grass right now. Texas fixing to go into Oklahoma. Poor Joe Trucker bringing all the good stuff on a big truck. Safety tip for today. Leave the distance in between your truck and your car. And don't drive beside a big truck. If the tire blows out, you're in very big danger of the rubber flying and hitting your car or coming through your windshield. Get around a big truck if you're going to pass or leave it, get it behind and leave the distance. Or Joe Trucker, we're out.